Good afternoon. This is Mark Harrison with Sewer Line Check Professionals. I am here at 345 South Swall Drive in Beverly Hills, and I am preparing to perform a video examination of the main sewer line here on the property. Now, the main sewer line is the portion of the waste drainage piping that is exterior to the structures. It lies underground and connects the building drain line systems to the public sewer. The building drain line systems enter the portions of the waste drainage piping that would be underneath or interior to the structures. Our examination today is not focused on the building drain line system, so if further evaluation is desired regarding the building drain line system, a licensed plumbing contractor should be contacted, or a specialty building drain line video examination to be set up through our office. So I'm going to be performing my examination today from this 4-inch main sewer line cleanout we found here in the planter area at the back of the main house, right between the, uh, the main structure here, where the patio area out the back, and the uh, French doors to the guest house. You look just opposite of these French doors, you'll see this clean out here in this planter area. Now what this is going to do is going to drop us into the main sewer pipe. We're going to run under the slab of the guest house area and then out under the alley to connect up to the public sewer. Knocked a little debris in there when I was opening the cap. So basically what we're running through here is a modern plastic piping and this runs underneath the slab here of the guest house and then connects up to an original pipe at the uh, edge of the alley. So this section here is not original. It was upgraded or put in when we uh, had the guest house structure built probably. We got some water running in the bathroom of the guest structure. That's uh, what you're seeing here. And the main purpose for that is just to keep my camera lens clean and to illustrate that that does tie in. All right, here we're uh, Changing pipe materials now, making a slight turn to run out under the alley. Also increasing in pipe diameter from 4 inch to 6 inch. It looks like we've got a fairly short section here. So we're going from about 31 feet to about 35 where we connect it to our public sewer. We're starting to see some root intrusions here at this connection. And then there's some more at the next connection. Uh, but there is some damage at the next connection. The root intrusions in these clay lines is fairly common and uh, normally we would be suggesting that they can be maintained with regular sewer line cleanings. It's uh, when they're left unmaintained for extended periods that they can create blockages in the system or potentially damage a pipe. And as we come up here, it's a little hard to see with the roots in the area, but if you look at the lower left here, you're going to see there's a crack, a pretty good crack in that section of pipe just before that connection. And uh, up at the upper right, you see that there's a, a pretty good separation there. So this looks like the uh, area has been compromised by the roots, or uh, has been compromised and then the roots got in. So this is something I would certainly recommend for repair. Now, uh, very likely, this can be repaired with a, a lining system and uh, what's known as a top hat pops in from the uh, city sewer side so that this entire line is rehabilitated. It would probably be more cost effective to do something like that and just go ahead and rehabilitate this whole section of uh, clay pipe, uh, including the connection to the public sewer and uh, excavation under the alley. It's a, close to eight feet deep there. So uh, if this is a candidate, which I believe it will be, uh, an approved lining system may be the the best option here. That of course should be discussed with the sewer contractor chosen to perform the repair, but uh, nothing here that I'm seeing shows me that it should should not be. Okay, so uh, basically what I'm going to do is go ahead and conclude the video portion of this examination for today. Now I'll be issuing a written report to review along with this video which will describe those final findings and repair recommendations. This is Mark Harrison with Sewer Line Check Professionals. Thank you very much and have a pleasant day.